Hello and welcome to the Blender Hobbyist. In this video, I want to show you a very useful Blender <coughs> add-on ArcMesh, which is you can use for architecture in Blender. It is very useful, and uh, I want to show you uh, how you can use it. If you want to watch a, a full tutorial, this is not for you. Don't waste your time. This is just a quick overview and what is in, uh, how you can import it and what is in the ArchMesh. First of all, I want to go to I want to go to uh, Blender Docs. You can uh, see how you can use it and its interface and please check the documentation of Blender if you want to uh, learn very detail. <laughs> so this video is just a quick overview. So let's start it. And first of all I want to show you how to import it. It is very easy. Go to preference, click uh add-on and search for arc and sorry arc you can see there are two <laughs> uh, add-on architect and archimesh both of them are uh, very useful but in this video i want to uh, uh, speak to you about archimesh and click it and save your preference now if you click it you can see uh, you have to click and button and I want to show you the short keys no. please click and button and go to create now you can create a room and many things in this uh, add-on <laughs> if you click room you can see there is a wall here and you can adjust its height and width nope base okay you can increase for example 4 meter and if you want to make a rule make it make this wall four meter and if you wanted to make four meter please click negative four and fourth wall and negative four and now you have a room and you can add a floor here you can You can add a floor, add a ceiling, but not now. And you can close it, make it room. First of all, your room high is 2.5. I'm going to make 2.6. And now click this wall. And you can curve it like this you can make it wall visible and you can increase your wall adjust it and now please click tab and nope. you can add a column which is uh, well, it will come here and you can see here there is adjustment you can make it circular rectangular circular is good and you can increase radius and high 2.6 and you can add circular top and 
you can add a arch and you can adjust it and now you can add a door please use uh, this empty to move this uh, door and sorry and now sorry okay of course two door is X. door frame door 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 and you can add a shelf for your books you can add stairs like here oh sorry where's stair bring it back here you can add a roof and no if you wanted to add a roof X. click here tap come to here and please click shift s cursor to select it and now add a roof and now you can adjust it for example for here yeah and you can or X okay you can add it and you may can you can make it use modifier add a modifier mirror modifier where it is okay for x y to increase or decrease your roof you can add a lamp which is here I can show you you can add a roller curtain you can see it's, it's very uh, good you can add a add books and bring it here no nope. control z at books and you can increase your book number and you can increase your randomness 0 0.3 so it w it will look more realistic or oh, sorry a Nope. 
add books randomness and so it's gonna look more realistic and finally here you can add a Japanese curtain or a Venetian blind and you can look at your um, detail of your uh, design I know it's not a very good design but I just want to show you what is in arc mesh and you can see here it looks better and you can see I will add here sorry I will add uh, another roof to show you model 2 model 3 model 4 yeah you can see there are many models of roofs and one to one and model one is it looks good and number of tile one one here zero Yep, if you use model 2, you can increase this and rotate it to Z ninety degree. Yeah, now you can see here you have cover of your roof for two part of your roof of course it's not a very good design but just I want to show you how it is and you can add a cabinet finally I don't know where it is okay here you can adjust it it's high it's for flow for wall and for floor and you can adjust it to sorry two shells yeah you can see and you can export your uh, design and what the most beautiful uh, thing about this Archimesh is you can uh, make a room from draw for example Yeah, it just read as a door or room wall, sorry. But 
you can make it if you because I made it just one okay like this one I'm going to yeah you can see it's it's very 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 useful now if you want to learn if you, uh, you are interested in archi architecture and you want to learn archimesh of course you can you have to read many uh, documentation and you have to watch many full tutorials I just wanted to show you a, a quick tutorial what's in archimesh just this is the end of my video if you like it please subscribe my channel and click like button and continue to uh, use learn your uh, this add-on Archimesh add-on thanks for watching